here I am back and I'm so sorry my last two or three videos were like so you I was like all over the place I didn't realize what all I was saying and it was just you know um, a total mess hot cold mess whatever it is but the giant towers are still there lights are on they are working on it and what am I doing? It's about 7, 7.30 in the evening. I'm home and I am... You can't see if there's no light. Okay. I am sitting here with a glass of Malibu. Um, I'll have another. Let's be honest. And that's the beautiful sky. See? Yeah. It's beautiful. And you can see the city traffic. And I just realized a lot of the view from... Uh, so that side. Wait, I'll show you which side. A lot of the view from that side will also eventually get covered because apparently they're building another tower there. Um, so can't help it. My teenage boy has grown very tall. He's actually reached the roof. I need to trim this down, but I don't have the heart to, you know, put the gardening scissors or whatever. What do you call it? Shearing? to it but I'll eventually have to do that I've redu reduced a lot of the plants because I gave them away to the gardener and it's getting dark so I know you can't see much but still you know still whatever you can see I can't show you my face because it's too dark and you won't be able to see anything but I just wanted you to see the sky and this is what I'm seeing right now okay and I also wanted to genuinely say sorry because a lot of you beautiful people commented on my previous videos, reached out to me on WhatsApp and Instagram and uh, said a lot of kind words, offered to help me out emotionally, uh, reached out to me in beautiful ways and I don't remember if I have responded. I don't think I have responded because I was in a very bad space. But yes, uh, I am getting back. Uh, I'm still <laughs> very uh, up and down in my emotions I am learning not learning honestly I'm trying to control and trying to learn and every day is a learning process I'll be honest a lot of things are going on and yes I am searching for a job I didn't get a job yet because uh, most of the places I have applied to they have said that either I'm overqualified for what they're looking for or there's a lot of work but the pay is horrible it doesn't make sense or uh, there's a lot of recession not recession there are a lot of layoffs happening so you know they're not able to hire me right now but for most of the <laughs> places i'm a bit overqualified because um so you know they can't accept my uh profile right now it's not a match and uh, they're looking for junior uh employees so it's not happening yeah but um that's what's there and uh, I have to see how I work that out mm, I have not uh, really been here in a long time I have not really been watching YouTube really and I have not even been reading you know I have just been not sulking but I've just been um, you know I've just been very low kind of not in the mood so I have I, okay, so I'll tell you, 2023, I read 118, 118 books. I saw my journal and it was like 118 books I read. Very interesting ones. Now, this year, this is already the second month. Today is 11th. Yeah, 11th of February. Um, and, you know, I have read only 1, 2, 3, 4 only four books this year and uh, because i'm not getting any that you know i'm I'm getting so bored about everything I, I was not able to read nothing was getting my attention everything was just uh, honestly i have been sleeping a lot curled up inside my comforter one thing that i have started doing is i have started going out and meeting my friends and uh, the few friends that i have i've been meeting them um I have been trying to find ways to um, reduce my alcohol intake which has really really become like kind of a daily habit and I'm not going to 
I'm not going to become that person. I'm not judging anybody here, but I'm just saying I don't want to do that. So, hmm. So I don't want to do that. I have also unfortunately started smoking, which definitely is not something I'm promoting or saying that um, I should be doing. I should not be doing it. I have a very vain reason why I should not be doing. Of course, the health aspect is there. Another vain reason that I have, and then again, I'm not judging anybody, is that I do not like. I I have heard, or I think that when you smoke regularly, your lips turn brownish. I don't want that. I have. very simple plain regular lips and i don't want them to turn brown so that's a very vain reason and uh, yeah i have to definitely go about of that i have uh, i have been i have started walking and going out i have reduced um, some weight and uh, i'm not sick i have reduced weight i'm not sick but uh, yes again very vain reasons I wanted to become kind of invisible to the world uh but yeah I started eating healthier I started uh, my basic exercising which is walking and I got a bit healthier so that's good now I need to figure out the work aspect and see how it goes right now I can't even say I'm in between jobs right now let's just say I am unemployed <laughs> and uh, I don't know what I'm going to do in the future but uh, I will do something I hope uh i'll have to figure out some things um yes i'm loving the color of the sky isn't it beautiful it is it's beautiful it's a lot of hustle bustle beautiful colors out there so many people out there uh i have been sitting here every day like when i'm at home i've been sitting here every day during i mean sunset and just uh, the city lights the sky it's kind of keeping me cheerful and happy and i've just i've been listening to a lot of music mm, it's helping me a lot so yes remember uh, i don't know if you if you remember or if you even saw that video i had posted a long time back that i will be talking about my um, addictions and what happened and uh, mistakes i've done in the past but i will talk about it and uh, plus i have not come in front of the camera in a long time and it doesn't feel that i'm talking to you to me it doesn't feel like i'm talking to you so i will do that just i don't want to come in front of the camera with a sad sulking face nobody wants to see a sulking face right so yes of course i'll definitely be very um open and honest about my feelings but i want to be there um soon most likely on friday or uh maybe monday Th- today here in india it's monday and it's 11th of february so um, i'll do something i will i think put up a video on friday and tell you all about my uh problems with addiction and stuff like that so yes now i think i need to go do something it's okay you take care of yourself okay Uh, yes so hi uh yeah before you go again i will just show you the sky okay it is beautiful it is yeah someone's at the door i'll just uh, go now and i like i said i smoked two cigarettes and i had one malibu actually i am still half fit through that one glass of malibu it's mild i made it I want to have one more sit out here for an hour or so and then I'm going to go and maybe do something. I don't know maybe uh, if I'm okay I'll go for a walk. If I'm not feeling that great I will watch some true crime. So that that keeps me interested, you know, true crime. I don't know how watching true crime keeps me feeling very I don't know, true watching true crime kind of makes me calm. Uh, it's very fished up. but yeah it does so <laughs> so for now i'll just say bye bye and uh, my smiles are back if you like if if you can't hear it you can go to my instagram account and check it of course it's just there belina raja there so if you are there if you are on instagram please um i'm not saying follow me but at least drop me a message on instagram and tell me who you are and uh, yeah i'll definitely love to see you if you're there so yeah this is me and sky is already turning different right so it's beautiful 
So you take care of yourself. I'm sending out lots of love and hugs and positive vibes and smiles. And I hope you have a great, great start to the week. I love you guys so much. You take care of yourself. Bye-bye.